I woke up in a strange world full of noobs, not knowing who I was or how I had gotten there. I sought an old man who could give me those answers, but when I found him, he attacked. You will be thrown off this mountain and never be seen again, assassin! Wait, I can prove I'm a human! I'm not an assassin like you say I am! I don't believe you. Your time is up! His name is Nubin! What? Huh, <sighs> the governor's name. It's Nubin. Why did I just say that? How do you- There are only a few people who know his real name. And last I checked, you weren't one of them. How do you know it? I met this noob mayor. Bernie. <laughs> Bernie? Should have known. He never could keep his mouth shut about anything. Oh man, this mountain is way taller than I thought. The last thing I want to do is fall again. That hurts so much. Oh, would you look at that? A treehouse. Wow, this is way cooler than my place. Even if you were a human, you could have still been set here to assassinate oh, me. Oh, I found the stranger! And the other stranger. No, I would never do that! This is your last chance! Hey, strangers! Stop! <laughs> oh, my! That's the second time that's happened. That's gotta hurt. <laughs> you still could be an assassin with a cloak on. Show your face and prove to me that you are in fact a human. I... wait, why can't I show him my face? I don't know what was wrong, but something was keeping me from revealing my face to him. I don't know who I am, but for some reason I know not to show my face to anyone, not even him. I can't. If I was an assassin, don't you think I would have attacked you by now though? You're not exactly in your prime youth, you know. You're saying I'm old? Yes. Fair enough. Okay, to really prove to you that I even am a human, what would I have to do? <sighs> it wouldn't be easy. I'll do anything to find out who I am. Just tell me. Alright, come with me. You will have to traverse Noob Fields, a place outside the border of this nation, in a place you will find to be unexplainable. There are things that happen in this zone that border on the imagination. It will trick your mind into seeing things that aren't really there. So keep your guard up and be careful. Okay, what am I looking for in noob fields? Hopefully the answers you've been looking for. Now here's a map that will guide you there. Whoa. If that's the boundary of noob nation, then what's outside noob fields? Uh, nothing. You dare not go past noob fields. It's dangerous. Okay, that's not cryptic at all. Just don't deviate from the path. Trust me. So I set out on my adventure to Noob Fields, climbing down the mountain that took so long to climb, and I just- Stranger, it's you! I, I finally made it up here! Well, I'm climbing down now, so... Are you serious? I'm afraid of heights! I fell twice! And now you're saying that once I finally get back up here, it's time to head back down? Yep, pretty much. Oh, well in that case, where are we headed? I don't know where you're headed, but I'm going to Noob Fields. Noob Fields? I've heard stories about that place. I wouldn't go there if I were you. Well, I have to if I want to find out who I am and what I'm doing here. At least, that's what the old man told me. Uh, Billy? Not again! Oh gosh. Oh well. I made it down the mountain safely and started traveling to Noob Fields. The further I got away from Noob City, the weirder things got. The path was getting narrower, and everything was turning to dirt. Don't get me wrong, there was a lot of dirt before, but now everything was dirt. The trees had turned to dirt, and the one thing that wasn't turned to dirt were these stone statues. How did they even get out here? Someone had to make these at some point, right? What were they doing here? I walked a little further and came across a fork in the path. The map doesn't say anything about this. Which way do I go? Well, I guess I can't really go wrong with going right now, can I? <laughs> Little did I know... Right was wrong! Right was wrong! I'm gonna die! Okay. Left it is. I walked further down the path, and what I saw shocked me. What is going on? The ground is moving! Look at that! There's dirt just zooming across the landscape! The old man was right. The further I got from civilization, the crazier things get. How did he put it? Things that border on the imagination? Yeah, he was right. And what I saw next completely proved his point. Giant dirt statues moving across the land. Let me say that again. Giant dirt statues moving across the land. I don't even have words to express how cool that is. This place is awesome. I could... I could spend my life here. I just 
want to go up to them and climb on top of them. They're just... Wait, why am I acting like this? The old man said that things out here will try to trick my mind into seeing things that aren't really there. This isn't real, is it? Yo, what? What are those things? Oh my gosh! Dude! Uh. Oh, what? They can't go on the path! Oh my goodness! Huh. I just have to stick to the path and I'll be fine, I think. This is nuts! I walked on the path for what seemed like an hour. The beast stopped chasing me, and now I'm in an even weirder place. There's just dirt floating in the sky, and some of them are moving like before, but this was really trippy. You know, this was all fine and dandy, but the path has just ended, and I am staring at the entrance of a cave. One that I cannot see the end to. Okay, I guess this is where the path has been leading me. <gasps> Dude, what was that? What is that? Well, I am definitely not going off the path now. Who knows what could be out there? One thing that I've learned is that anything is possible in this world. I entered the cave cautiously and immediately met three different paths. Well, last time I went right and that was wrong, so surely it will be the right choice this time. <laughs> See what I did there? I'm sure I have nothing to worry about. Not good! Not good! Bats! Bats everywhere! Bats all over me! Ugh. Okay. Well. Middle it is. I kept going further into the cave until it opened up into a room full of lava. Whoa, what is this place? I'm supposed to get across that? Greetings, that. adventurer. Where did you come from? I am the guardian of this cave. My sole purpose is to protect the secrets of this land. The path ahead is treacherous, but the rewards will be found at the end of the tunnel. To complete this challenge, one must be in unity. Only then can you achieve true success. Okay, so I get to use the contents of this chest too? Correct. Alright, we got some interesting items. So this is just a parkour course? Should be easy enough, right? I flew through the first half of the course, but with each jump I made, the parkour got harder and harder. Until I came across a jump that I'm sure was impossible. That's five blocks. And the one after that looks impossible too. What is this? How am I supposed to complete it if there are impossible jumps? Wait, okay, I know this sounds crazy, but I think I have to jump into the lava. I just have this feeling that this is the only way I can complete this challenge. But that means if I'm wrong, I am totally dead. All right, here goes nothing. Oh, 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 let's go. I was right. There were blocks underneath the lava. Dude! Yo, that freaked me out for a second though. And now I'm free to get the rewards. But wait, hold on. What is this now? It's sealed off. I don't know how to get through unless things are not always as they seem. Somewhere on this wall is a secret passage and I have to find it. I inspected the wall and came to the conclusion that I had to place these four pots on the cobblestone blocks. This opened something and I could walk through the fake wall. I don't know how I figured this out, but at least I made it. Congratulations! Yo, what? How did you get there? Things are not always as they seem. <laughs> Bro could just teleport to the other side? Why couldn't I do that? Now follow the tunnel and you should find what you were looking for. Alright. I walked a little bit further and then the ground beneath me gave way. <gasps> no, 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 no! I am alive. I landed in water? Ugh, this isn't good. How do I get back up there? I- wait, hold on. I know this place. I can't explain it, but I feel like I've been here before. Whoa, I have to find out where this leads. I crept forward, astounded by what I had found. I don't think this was a part of the plan. I explored the deep, dark depths of the underground, and then I came across a small room with a chest at the center of it. It was so out of place, but here goes nothing. It's a book. <gasps> Dear reader, if you're reading this, then it means something has gone horribly wrong. The world is not the same as it once was. I fear the war is much more devastating than previously anticipated, but there is hope. From distant shores a foe will bring, to all the land the bells must ring. 
a foreigner for whom destiny, destiny calls to, to save, save the, the world, world or let it fall. <laughs> Whoa, this just got real. Oh, there, there's another page. Oh, wait, it's cut off. I don't think this is the full story. I have no idea what any of this means, but if there is anyone who would know, it would be the old man. He's the one who sent me out here, after all. This must have been what he wanted me to find. I just don't know how to get out of here. Just as I said that, I heard a rumbling, and I could feel the ground beneath me shake, and then I was outside. Okay, I guess I just got teleported? You must leave! It isn't safe! Now go! Okay, why wasn't it safe? What is happening? I have so many questions swirling in my head, but right now I just need to get back to civilization. I ran down the path, not stopping to see all the illusions that I had seen earlier. As cool as this place was, it was obviously very dangerous, and I just wanted to get packed to Noob City as quickly as possible. Stranger! What? It's me, Billy! I tried following you, but I ended up getting lost. You went right, didn't you? <laughs> yep. I'm on my way back to Noob City if you want to come with me. Yes, thank you. I, I don't normally say this, but this has been the best day ever. What? You fell off a mountain twice and got thrown off a third time, and then you tried following me into Noob Fields where you just got lost and then mauled by a bunch of wild beasts, probably almost dying several times in the process, and you say it's been a good day? No, the best day ever. Why? Because I got to go on an adventure with my best friend! Wow, you are literally the definition of an optimist, aren't you? That's right! We traveled back to Noob City and eventually climbed up the mountain to meet up with the old man. And don't worry, Billy didn't fall this time. <laughs> you made it back! I am impressed! Do you have the staff for me? Staff? No, you... You wanted a staff? Yes, that's what I set you out there to do. Uh, I thought this book was what you wanted me to find. Does he even know about it? Did I discover something I wasn't supposed to? I didn't find a staff, but I found this book instead. More like notes, actually. I was hoping you could explain it to me because I have no idea what it means. <gasps> no, this can't be. What? What is it? The prophecy. The one everyone has been searching for for years. You... You discovered it. Prophecy? Yes. This... this changes everything. You are changing everything. What does that mean? It means you are going to meet with the new king right away, and he is going to be the one to decide your fate. 